Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, video number two. I'm trying to pre-record a lot for y'all because I'm gonna be busy moving and these need to be scheduled as much as they can because I'm probably gonna be moved in Saturday, I think. So anyway, so anyway, so the question was, do you have a moving spell? And yes, I do actually, I have a moving spell. It is a protection and money spell. And the reason why is because moving is a lot it takes a lot of energy and you don't have a lot of time to do what you got to do but you know anything can go wrong that's why I always cast a protection spell and a money spell and I'm gonna combine the spell with this video so you can see what I do and how I do it but I'm gonna show you the items I have here before it gets to the, to the spell part so let me grab some items so um So, what you're going to need is, or what I use, is I'm going to be using a white plain taper candle, and I'm going to carve protection and money, okay? I'm going to use these birthday candles, okay? I'm just going to be using three, because that's my number when I'm working with my main deities, spiritual incense, cinnamon, salt, and frankincense and myrrh oil, okay? And this is, ooh, this is a basic moving spell I do every single time I move. It's on my playlist, or not my playlist, it's on my spells in the past. I always did a protection spell. I always did a money spell. Um, there's a spell in my last playlist, in my last, a year ago, I did moving out my old apartments to, um, it was um, a spell with St. Jude I did um, where I, did it with him before I moved. So, um, yes, yeah, so we're gonna get to the spell. But yes, I do have a, a moving spell I do. It is for moving um, with protection and money. So yes, I do have a moving spell. So I hope you enjoy this spell. I hope you, I hope this answered your question and have a great night and blessed be. Love you guys. guys so if you've seen the first part of this video you already know what's happening here um i'm just getting everything set up i just lit um some uh spiritual incense this is the moving spell i was just explaining in the end um i'm about to explain what i'm doing just give me a second in the name of the father the son and the holy spirit from the Father and Son and Holy Spirit into the space to do this moving spell. In Jesus' name. Um, when I usually run out of juice, I will like light this and like light my candle. So, so um, yeah. So basically, we're here to do the moving spell that I promised y'all I had. Hang on, I hear my anyway, washer. Anyway, sorry about that. My washer started making weird noises. But anyway, um, so we're doing a moving spell. Um, so yeah, basically I was gonna explain some things to you. So I made this um, little thing, you know, like th maybe three, two years ago. Um, so this little candle is his working candle. It's a protection candle. So whenever I'm doing a working with him, it automatically like protects me as I'm doing a working, no matter what working it is. And I thought that was, I would want to know that. And also this candle though, this bad boy right here is um, a cloaking candle. So whenever I'm doing any type of working, the reason why I don't have it lit right now is because it's not like, this is just, um, you know, uh, for moving. So if it's not like deep or anything, I won't light it. I'll just have these lit. But if it's like, um, you know, to, uh, it's just hard to explain. I don't know how to explain it to you more than when I'm actually lighting it. 
basically like if I'm doing any curses or hexes or jinxes or unhexing somebody or breaking a curse on somebody then I like that bad boy so no one can sense that I'm breaking that curse off of somebody or cursing somebody basically but this one's just slip for regular so no one can sense if I'm moving or whatever so anyway that's just point blank period um so I'm gonna go ahead and show you the candle I'm using it's very um, dirty but it's a white regular candle so we're gonna go ahead and write on it I'm writing on it um my regular stuff that I usually use it for so I'm gonna I'm gonna I don't have any of my regular colors so I just grab what's here and so I'm gonna write on here money I'm gonna write on here moving I'm gonna write on here protection because the main point of it is protection and money but I wrote in the center moving because I do the two spells at the same time but so I wrote the money on top and the protection on the bottom, but I put the main center of Y in the middle. It's moving. So I put the move, the money on top and the protection on the bottom because the main reason why we're doing this spell is because we're moving. So if that makes any sense. So I'm gonna go ahead and burn some sage. Um, yeah, I'm gonna probably make a good little update video soon because I'm running out of time. I have like a couple more videos I wanna do. But basically, there's, um, let me just, I don't know. I'm just going all over the place with this video. But basically, like, there's a lot of stuff that I want to do. I have a protection mix to make. I have a money sachet that I'm already getting ready to make with y'all. Um, this is my old one. I emptied it, and I'm going to cleanse it out and make a new one with y'all. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and do this real quick. So, um. This is what I feel to do. So in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, I bless and activate this sage out. In Jesus' name, as an offering right now. In Jesus' name, I bless and activate this sage as an offering unto the angels. In Jesus' name. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, I bless and activate this sage as an offering. In Jesus' name. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. this be. wanted to get an offering going real quick I don't know I just felt like I needed it so we're gonna go ahead and get everything started um okay I take my engagement ring off when I do this stuff because it just gets all oily so I'm just gonna go ahead and use what we need but um I like I was saying I'm just running out of time and everything because it's already Wednesday I'm recording like I pre I'm pre-recording this the video you saw before this video that I'm doing now was Tuesday. It's Wednesday now, currently. So, like, I'm just running out of time. This is all pre-recorded. So, by the time this is posted, it's going to be probably Friday. So, I don't know. Like, I'm pre-recording a lot of stuff. So, yeah. I'm just trying to make sure I have a lot of time for everything that I want to get done. So, yeah. So, in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, I bless and activate this frankincense and myrrh oil to completely amplify this protection, to completely amplify this money coming in, to keep our money flow going and concurrently flow, to flow and to flow in Jesus' name. I command in Jesus' name our protection to amplify by the blood of Jesus. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, with the help of my ancestors, guides, and angels, in Jesus' name I pray. Amen. So that's just basically what I have right there. It's just a white candle, but I'm gonna add some more stuff to it. Um, oh no, it's a little crooked, but it's okay. Um, <clears throat> let's see. Oh, I'm also making a spray too. 
I know I'm telling y'all a lot of stuff, but I'm making a spray. So I have like three more videos coming. Okay, um, let's see here. Let's see what I feel to do next. Okay, so now we're gonna take a uh, gray candle. You can get these at the Dollar Tree, Dollar Store, and Walmart. I feel to do two, so I'm gonna do two. I always go with my gut. And I have some protection oil I got a long time ago. And I'm gonna take a dab and rub them both in it. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, I bless and activate this protection and oil to protect my home, my brand new home that I'm going to, to protect my money, to protect the house that I'm going to, to make it feel like a loving and new peaceful home in Jesus' name. By the blood of Jesus, by the power of God's magic, it is done. In Jesus' name, I command it. Amen. And then I have a little mixture down here, of uh, um, muddy mixture. I'm just gonna do a little dip dip. See, just a little dip dip so I can have the muddy mixture on there. Never mind, I dropped them in there and did a little dip dip. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, I bless and activate this um, money mixture right now in Jesus' name to amplify the money flow as we go to our new home, that the money will be constant, and the money will be constantly coming in, constantly there, and always on time to pay our bills and to constantly make our worth in Jesus' name. With the help of my guides, ancestors, and angels, it is done in Jesus' name, I pray. And the thing that makes it simple is you don't have to add a, add a lot of stuff. So that's good. Um, so yeah. Alright. Now I can just put this over here. Alright. So next, the last thing we're going to do, believe it or not, is all we're going to add is some blessed salt. But what I'm going to do is grab some salt from under here that I have under my altar that you saw on the witchy room tour and which it's the same thing it's just pure salt but um ow shit um which I do have some blessed salt right there in the corner but this is for the spell And you're like, wow, that's a lot of salt. Well, you know, you can never use too much salt, but look at that, how pretty. So we're gonna, oh no, my two candles. Oh, well, that's true. It's gonna be in the salt, so it, it needs to be off the salt. So we're gonna do this. Oh no, now my other candle's starting to fall. Y'all, I am totally unprepared. Look at that. Look at that. Give me a second. Okay. Now we're back. All right, Um. so I fixed it, but <laughs> I don't know. All right, so in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, I bless and activate this salt to completely protect my home, the brand new home that I'm going to, to bring peace and nothing but harmony, protection, cloaking, and nothing but money and prosperity in my home. 
and nothing is allowed in my home that is evil and a negativity and negative energy in Jesus name I thank you for my help of my guides ancestors and angels Archangel Michael the Father Son and Holy Spirit and Saint Mary in Jesus name I pray and command it done in Jesus name All right, and that's pretty much it for that. Um, I'm just about to activate it and the spell's gonna be active. And everyone's spells are different. That's all I'm gonna really say, but um, after this, basically, it's, I'm just gonna let it burn. And that's pretty much it. So this is a simple moving spell. So yes, this is an answer to your question. I have a moving spell. This is a money and protection spell. So. In the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, I activate this protection spell and this money spell right now in Jesus' name. I command protective energy in Jesus' name to come into this new home that me and my fiance will be living in. In Jesus' name, right now, on top of my guides, ancestors, and angels, in Jesus' name, I command it to be done. In the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, I activate this spell in Jesus' name. By the blood of Jesus. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, in Jesus' name. I activate the spell of protection and this act I activate the spell of money in Jesus' name. With the help of my guides, ancestors, and angels and Archangel Michael and the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit and Saint Mary in Jesus' name to protect this new home that we're going to, to bring spiritual protection, physical protection, and financial protection in Jesus' name, to bring a constant money flow in Jesus' name. I thank you, Archangel Michael. There's nothing but spiritual protection there and peace and no obstacles in our way. I thank you to the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. That there's nothing but love and peace and harmony and spiritual protection and spiritual growth and a constant money flow coming in. I thank you, St. Mary, that there is a constant money flow and that there is protection there in Jesus' name, and no enemies are allowed in or allowed to find us. In Jesus' name, I decree and declare this done by Saint Mary, Archangel Michael, and the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, and my ancestors, guides, and angels. In Jesus' name, it is done. Amen. In Jesus' name, it is done. Amen. I command this in Jesus' name. Amen. All right, guys. Well, that was a simple moving um moving spell it was a combined combination of money and protection so um i'm gonna go ahead and show you what i do after i do any type of spell whether it be curses or hexes or moving or healing or whatever it might be i get some florida water and this is what i do because i just feel a little bit better after i just wash my hands and that's what i do i just rub my little wrist and I feel a little bit better. And I'm like, okay, you know, the energy's off my hands, and then I just do that. And sometimes, when I don't have things in my bowl, what I'll do is get some some water, and I'll get some salt and water, holy water, and I'll put my bowl in front of me, I'll pour some salt in my hands and some holy water, and I'll wash my hands. <laughs> so it just depends. But anyway, I hope you guys like this spell. Um, it's very simple and easy, very effective and very, um, um, let's just say it could happen the next day um, with the money flow. The protection's automatically set no matter what, but um, I hope you guys liked it. Leave a comment down below what spells you would like to see next, um, and I will see you guys next time on the next video. I love you guys, and by the next three videos, I should be moved. So, I love you guys, and I'll see you next time. All right? Bye. Well, another thing I want to make note of is that because of, you know, of the process of moving, I let the birthday candles burn all the way out, which I'm doing now. I'm just putting my intent into it. And look, it's very active already. Like, there's no air on because it's very cold where I'm at right now already. But, um, ooh, copyright. No, no copyright. No. YouTube. Don't copyright me. I shut the door. Um, um, but it is very cold where I'm at, so it's just very active already. But um, I let the um birthday candles burn out, and then I put this out. Like I'll either get some salt and throw it on there, or I will um wet my fingers and put it out, and then like light it back up tomorrow night. Put my intent into the to the big candle, and then until. Friday night, which is my last night here, or Saturday night, 
which is no Friday night and let it burn out all night to complete the spell completely. And people are like, why don't you just let it burn all night? Because, you know, it's just how I feel the spell needs to be done. Which usually, the spell would usually just be complete when one night. But this time, I felt like the spell needs to be done in a couple of days. So that's how I'm going to do it. So these birthday candles are almost done. So that's just how I'm doing it. So I just feel like sharing that with you. So... And usually when the breath of candles look, so like usually when the breath of candles are like right here by the salt, you see how I was about to start burning the salt. I usually just go ahead and put the salt like this so it don't start a fire, but it's not going to affect your spell or anything like that because people who think that don't know what they're talking about, like really. So then what I usually do is this. So like I'll usually do that and there you go. And then I'll say... The spell is paused in Jesus name or the spell is, um, yeah, the spell is paused in Jesus name until tomorrow, you know, or the spell is active still in Jesus name, just on pause. You know, you got to put it in the atmosphere. You got to put it in the spiritual realm so the angels know what's going on because you can't just, you know what I'm saying? Because it cancels out everything. So, I'm saying out loud right now, in the name of Jesus, my spell is active, but it is on pause at the moment until tomorrow night. So, you know what I'm saying? So, my spell is active still. It is active still in the spiritual realm. The angels are still working of putting my protection up and bringing the money in, but it's just on pause on my end. Like, I'm pausing my part. But the angels are still working on their part. You see what I mean? So I'm moving it to the side for tomorrow night. So it's just going to sit here on my altar for tomorrow. So that's just what I wanted to share with you. But all right. Good night. Um, I'm probably going to pre-record one more video or go to bed. I don't know. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. Goodbye. Subscribe to my YouTube channel.